Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for April the 2nd of 2021, well, it is titled NGC 3521 Galaxy in a Bubble. So what do we see here? Well, this is one of the bright galaxies in the constellation of Leo and is known by its catalog designation of NGC 3521. And this is an example of a spiral galaxy, although an unusual one, we can certainly see at the center there the traditional things we are used to seeing in a spiral galaxy with a central core and spiral arms swirling out around from it. And those spiral arms being populated by blue stars. So we see a bluish color within the spiral arms and the pink glow of hydrogen. So when the hydrogen is excited, it glows pink. And those are both signs of star formation within the spiral arms of the galaxy. Now what's unusual about this one is that it seems to be embedded in a bubble. So there seems to be a bubble of material scattered around it. And these this shell or these shells are actually likely debris from previous collisions with other galaxies. So when galaxies collide, especially small satellite galaxies that may have merged with this galaxy, they can leave behind streams of material that surround the galaxy. And in fact, we see tidal streams as part of our own galaxy as well as our galaxy has consumed some of its small satellite galaxies, uh, much as this one has in the constellation of Leo. Now galaxies do undergo mergers all the time and we see evidence for it in images like this where the spiral arms are somewhat distorted and we have lots of streams of material scattered around this from previous interactions with other galaxies. And again we see the same kind of thing with our own galaxy. And this is how galaxies grow over time. We see the streams now but over hundreds of millions of years those streams will calm down and the galaxy will once again look like an ordinary spiral galaxy until the next collision occurs. So this is how galaxies have built themselves up from the small galaxies present shortly after the Big Bang to the much larger spiral galaxies like the one we're looking at today. So we see a little bit in this of how galaxies evolve and change over time, slowly growing in size from very small objects, essentially large star clusters, to the galaxy sized objects we are used to looking at today. So that was our picture of the day for April the 2nd of 2021. It was titled NGC 3521 Galaxy in a Bubble. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be how far light travels over the weekend. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.